Location, location, location. It's important for real estate and it's important for the custom CSS in the default Joomla 4 template, Cassiopeia. It's changed in Joomla 4.1. Hey there, Joomla fans. Tim Davis here. I'm a Joomla fan too. Thanks for tuning in to Maintenance Monday number 222 here on the Basic Joomla Tutorials YouTube channel where I show you my favorite extensions, tools, and tips for building and maintaining Joomla sites. I also work on Joomla sites, so if you're looking to hire someone short-term or long-term or even just to get you out of a spot, send me an email, tim at cybersalt.com. As usual, this video is brought to you by our uh, channel sponsor, MySites.Guru. Head on over to MySites.Guru, get a free site audit for your Joomla site, and if you decide to subscribe, use the coupon code BASICJOOMLA, and you'll get your first month free. Okay, let's turn our attention to the screen, and we'll check this out. So as I mentioned, uh, Joomla 4.1 is out, and the, the the location to put custom CSS, your custom CSS file, in Cassiopeia, the default template for uh, Joomla 4, has changed. And I want to give a shout out to Mark DeChevre, who uh, wrote about this in an article in the Joomla magazine. I'll put a link in the video description below. There's also a link to a video when he appeared at the Jersey user uh, Joomla user group and did a talk uh, about a lot of things about Cassiopeia. So where's that new location and how to customize the CSS in the Cassiopeia? Here's how you can see. Uh, we go to the back end of a Joomla 4 website and we're going to go to system. We're going to go down to site templates. We're going to click on uh, Cassiopeia details and files. And now we need to create a file called user.css. It used to go into a CSS folder in the templates folder, but the new location is now in media, templates, site, and Cassiopeia. Now we want to put this file in the CSS folder, um, but if we just click on here, we'll see these files, but you will have to watch out for a little tricky thing. Uh, that is because uh, if you go new file, you know, here we've clicked on CSS, we're viewing that folder. If you go new file and create it, it's not going to go into that folder. You have to click it again. Once you have clicked it and it's highlighted, you can create it. And that file is called user.c, oh, user. <laughs> and then you select the file type CSS, you create it. And now it will appear over here where you can go and edit it. In fact, it's already, uh, having created it, it's already opened it up. Now, uh, here's where we, we want to put custom CSS. So for instance, here we have heading two, which is home. And I also have heading two in this article here. Why don't we change the custom CSS for heading two? I already have it here ready to paste. We'll just put that in there. I'm changing to four rem. That's going to be pretty big, uh, but we will save. And now when we go back to this page and do a force refresh, you'll see H2 is quite big. And that's what you need to know about the new location of the custom CSS file where you put your custom CSS in Cassiopeia, the default template for Joomla 4. I hope that was helpful for you. If it was, please subscribe, ring the bell to get notifications of new things here on the channel. And until the next time, enjoy your Joomla sites and God bless.